Guys, I have some very tragic news. I lost my hardcore world. I was exploring a mine shaft when all of a sudden a creeper came out of nowhere and blew up, killing me and ending my hardcore world. But that's okay because I just started a new one and <clears throat> thankfully there wasn't a lot of progress in that one. So it's pretty easy to just start all over again. So I created a new world and honestly, it, it's crazy how good it is. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'm sorry I lost the hardcore world, but trust me, this new one is going to be worth it. Like, <laughs> it is going to be worth it. Okay, there's no audio here. I had accidentally muted my microphone, so looks like we faced a lot of problems today, but basically what I'm talking about, I found this village, um, got done exploring a cave, got a bunch of iron, and basically recovered all the progress I'd lost from my old hardcore world. I found this really cool camel, which I saw for the first time in this world, because I've never actually found one of these. And yeah, that's really about it. I got my progress back by you know, getting some iron pretty quickly, all that good stuff. So, I wanted to catch you up here since there's no audio. Okay, I can't seem to find any area where it gets deeper underground, so I'm going to head back up and see if we can find another cave. Yo! Look at that! Is that an armadillo? It's so cute! Oh, I love it so much! Can I pet it? I wish I could- I don't know how to keep them, but I need one. That's adorable. Ooh, I got some rabbit meat. Okay. And I also got rabbit hide, which is pretty useless. But, you know, it might be of some use later on. I need to get out of this desert biome and into some plains or forest or something a little less barren. Is that, a, is that an oak tree? I swear, if that's a plains biome, I'm gonna be so mad. Okay, now this is a river biome. At least it's not a plains, because that, that would be quite... That would probably be the worst plains biome in history. Good news, a desert temple has been spotted. So, you know, in this new world, we are making more progress. I think more progress than before, just not as many pretty areas. Is that another village? Okay, that's crazy. Two villages in close proximity and a desert temple. If there's a good biome beside it, then we might have found the perfect area. But what we're going to do is head down into here. Hopefully find something good. I don't need an azalea. Fire aspect, that could be useful. Luck of the sea and density. Hold on, I'm going to look up what that is. Okay, so apparently that is for the mace, the new weapon, which I haven't seen yet, but could be very useful. This is some horrible loot. Impaling, obviously I'm going to impaling five, so the rabbit hide, and the diamond horse armor can be replaced with the clay. Overall, I would not say that was a very lucky find, but definitely better than what I could get. Don't need that there. We'll also check out this village since it's right here too. Another That's another desert temple. Two desert temples. Okay. Hold up. This might actually be one of the best seeds I've ever seen. A massive massive a massive uh village town area. And this isn't a horrible looking... You're joking! What? There's three! Okay, I am actually... There's something that has to be wrong. Is this a glitch? Three! Desert pyramids! Am I losing my mind? What? <laughs> this genuinely might be one of the greatest things I've ever seen. Three desert pyramids. Maybe, maybe this is making up for that loot I got in that last one. A golden apple. Okay, and armor trims. This is actually really good. Um, they stack, so that, that's good to know at the very least. Um, 
Gold, uh, we'll t Sweeping edge, we don't really need that. Okay, nothing too good here. Nothing to take. And a lot more gold. Okay. This wasn't actually- this actually wasn't bad. I'll admit, this was a fairly good pyramid. Not great, but still good. And then we still have one more we need to explore. The pillager outpost right beside it. Things are getting crazy. I genuinely think I'm going to settle down here. Because this... I don't know how this could get better. Anytime I say that, it gets better. So... We'll check out this desert pyramid, I guess. And if I swear, if I see another one, we're living here. Desert, four desert pyramids in a row. I could do incredible builds with that. Okay, I saw that well over there and it kind of gave me a mini heart attack. Okay, so we just need to check this one out. I don't see any other desert pyramids looking. I'll also put that above me because I don't, I don't trust that there's not going to be something that falls. I don't want that to happen. Another golden apple, that's good. We don't need any diamond, more diamond horse armor. Two more golden apples. Is that all that's in there? There's some iron we can get. And some gunpowder. More iron. Two more dunes. Another golden apple. And a saddle. Saddles don't stack, but honestly, I think we got some pretty good... We, that was a really good loot. I'm going to, I'm going to admit that. Three desert temples is absurd. That's unheard of. At least to me, that's unheard of. Because I've never heard of anyone getting that many desert temples all at once. So we need to find a way out of here. And there's a pillager outpost right there. I don't trust myself with that right now. Head over to this village. And... It's a large village, so we definitely got lucky with that. So the land geography, oh, well, that's the same thing, but the geography of this town doesn't look too clean, but that can always be fixed. But there's so much, and I, they have a lot of pigs, too. Go ahead and let me sleep in your bed. Thank you, good sir. Okay, yes, they do have a camel. Good. Um, let's see. I want to steal their belongings. There was a cactus right there. Strange. Does the Fletcher table do anything yet? No, it does not. They should make that, like, poison tip there. That would make things a lot easier. Oh, they also have a lot of cactus. Do you have anything? No, you do not. Okay, so other than having not-so-great geography or, like, world generation... In terms of like how the lands formed, it's a really good area, and I might end up building my house there. I just wish it were a bit closer to some living stuff because the mesa biome and a desert biome, there's not much of anything. There's also a pillar drought post, it would make raiding so much easier. Is that another villager town? How is there another? This is, okay, this is officially the greatest desert I've ever touched. Because three villages in pretty close proximity to one another. With a outpost and three desert pyramids. That is, like, that is crazy levels right there. Okay, it seems smaller. They have another camel. Actually, this town might feel... A little bit more open. This has much better geography than the other town, in my opinion, which makes it just better to look at overall. Um, can you move out my way, please? Thank you. Oh, creeper! That's been in my hardcore world last time. Another village. <laughs> what is going on today? Three? No, that's four. That's four villages and. Three desert pyramids. Okay, and a mine shaft, yeah, so this can... How? Okay, this one cuts right into the savannah, so obviously I'm not going to live at this one. This one is really... I feel like this one would have been prettier if it was just desert, but it's right there in the savannah, so... It's definitely not going to be in this town. I think I'm going to live right near 
the center of the first village I found because that one is by far the coolest. Okay, and then it changes biomes over there. Another town! What? There's also one of those new swamp biomes. I actually have not explored one of those yet. So, a mangrove swamp, that's going to be awesome. Because I, I love how it looks. Everything about it. So, this is literally the most perfect Minecraft world I can think of. It's so good. And the more I look at it, the more I'm starting to like the Mesa Desert Mix. So, I think I'm going to live right in the heart of that first village. Okay, I think we're gonna end the video here, guys. We've made a lot of progress. I'm really sorry about losing that first hardcore world, but this one I have significant hopes for, and I think that we can do it. I think we can make this last, because this, it's such a good area. There's so many great things to do. I'm gonna also gonna be a lot safer, because I was being really dumb in that last episode. So, you can call this the first episode, the second episode. That's completely up to you guys. But I hope you enjoyed the video. And if you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Leave a comment down below if you enjoyed and what you liked. Ideas for the future. Build ideas. Um, things you'd like to see. But uh, yeah, hope you guys have an amazing day. I'll see you guys again soon. Thank you for watching. Bye!